so this is my top three easiest puzzle video so let's think about it top three easiest puzzle and it doesn't need to take any of the wca events also well i guess and number one no that's not looking any good a bit better so at number three it is our pyramids what's so good about it it is one of the most easiest puzzle in the matter it doesn't even require any sort of typical algorithm stuff Oh no, the camera. Here you go. So at number three, we had pyramids because it is the most simplest puzzle out there. But there are another puzzle which are more, way more simpler than your regular three by three pyramids even. And there is a four by four pyramids. But currently, it is at number three in my list. My average on this is around thirty to thirty to twenty five seconds. But for a long time, I have not done any sort of practice in this puzzle specifically. But even then, I'm actually pretty good in that, and especially in this puzzle. So the reason why it is at number three is it doesn't require any sort of typical algorithm, which you may expect with a three by three or a four by four. No polarities if you done it correctly. And if there is no special type, and if there is no special case, which is usually not the case, okay, that was an unintended pun. Also, it is a three by three, and it's on number third spot, and there are three pointy edges and three pointy corners on it. So, an unexpected pun. Well, what can I do? Also. My one don't have any sort of magnets, but even then, it is so smooth, and it's actually very good. So if you want to break a world record, you can take a hand on this. At number two, we have a two by two, and again an unintended pun. So reason why it is at number two is not that it's a two by two. But it's the fact that it is some of the most simplest puzzle out there, and world record currently on this is even less than a second. So you can imagine how easy it is. And even though it may look very scrambled like this, but it's only four. But it's only few moves, so that you can solve it again. And it's actually pretty easy. Wait, let me do this all. Do something with this also. Okay. Yeah, number two. What? Where is it? I got it. So, what can be more easy than a two by two? Answer. A one by one. So, how to solve this thing? Done. It's that easy. So, it don't twist. Don't do any sort of corner cutting. It's very good actually in corner cutting because it don't have to do any sort of corner cutting. So what is this actually is? Uh, wait a minute. Bad focus. Okay, it's just a dice mode. Yeah, I just painted dice with different colors on each side, resembling a cube, a Rubik's cube, or again, or a three by three or two by two in a three by two or two by two color scheme. Basically. It is just a color mod, and it is not a WC event. It will never be a WC event. You cannot actually do anything with this. It just is. It is what it is. Wait, what I am saying? So, reason it is at number one because let's be obvious. You don't even have to scramble this. It is unscrambleable. It is always solved. Start timer. Solve. 
that is no that doesn't look good there we go so these are my top three most easy puzzles with okay so these are my top three most easy puzzle and in my collection and just give me a subscribe and a like also tell in the comments below which tutorial you want to see next after my 2 by 2 tutorial which will come um, soon i don't know how soon depending on how much time i have but yeah thanks for thanks for watching give me a like subscribe also we are going to do a giveaway so i will be pretty happy if you subscribe to my channel and i got and if i got 10 subscribers then i will do a giveaway one out of these three for one very very lucky person also i'm going to do a tutorial to make a one by one just for one for collectors collector purposes it can still be used as a dice and each color will represent a number no i'm just kidding or is it or am i i definitely see some potential this is what i'm doing so. so yeah it's me black goodbye